When it comes to planting cotton, there are several factors that influence the ability to achieve an optimal stand. One of those factors, of course, is weather. Environmental conditions drive all of our management decisions, especially in planting and how that seed will respond. The second major factor in cotton production is seed quality. We have seen the result of poor seed quality across the cotton belt over the past couple of years due to a variety of factors, including weather. However, inadequate warm and cool germ or early season vigor is always a major concern and growers should certainly pay attention to that when purchasing seed. A third important factor is seeding rates and final plant population. In situations when crop prices are low, cotton seed costs are continuing to increase, Growers may decide to lower seeding rates in hopes of maintaining a good stand and comparable yield. The last factor that has been a topic of discussion is seed size. In general, seed size differs with variety. There's been a, quite a bit of data that suggests seed size correlates with early season vigor, which can further benefit growth during unfavorable planting conditions. All of these factors combined play an important role in achieving a good cotton stand. In this research, we wanted to address some of these important factors. To do so, we had two different planting dates, an early planting of April 29th and a late planting of June 3rd. Planting cotton in June is typically discouraged. However, the month of May created a challenge with unseasonably cool weather early on and extremely wet weather in the last two weeks. These unfavorable conditions pushed our late planting back about a week. These unusual conditions made this year a good one to have a trial like this. We had four different seeding rates of 25, 35, 45, and 55,000 seed per acre with two varieties that were two different sizes. The large seeded variety was approximately 3,500 seed per pound, and the small seeded variety was approximately 5,500 seed per pound. This is the first year of this research and it is currently ongoing with data collection still underway. So far, we have noticed visually that the large seed variety had more vigor. Those plants look much healthier with the early and late planting. We had good planting conditions with soil temps in the upper 70s and low 80s. The week after this was planted, we had lows around 40 degrees with soil temps dropping to the upper 50s and low 60s. In addition, three weeks after planting, we had over 14 inches of rain over a 10 day period. So we certainly had a rough start to the season. Late planting, had much better conditions at planting time, but you can still see those differences in those seed sizes as the larger seed is more robust at this stage. To quantify early season vigor, we have collected seedling weight at four different growth stages early in the season, and we'll continue to collect late season growth data as well. Major question now is, do these early season differences translate into a yield response? We'll certainly share that information at a later time.